I'm back after having a good 18 months break from my garden um, and as you can see I let it go a little bit wild so I thought I'd do a video before I clear out and get started and get back into it and show you guys what grew with very minimal input so the first one was chilies so the little bird's eye chilies um, jalapenos they did really well all of my capsicums that I had growing they survived on neglect same with the eggplant so a lot of the perennial spinaches such as the Japanese and Brazilian spinaches they were fine we did also have some kale survive over that time period as well the Madagascan beans did their own thing as did the ginger and the turmeric so we've got lots to harvest of those at the moment so all of the things that just kind of popped up um, without me doing anything. So I had loads of coriander coming up. I had loads of um, cucumelon, all of um, the pak choys, lots of lettuce, lots of fennel, of course, sweet potato. It just comes up everywhere. Um, we also had lots of mustard greens and lots of different kinds of nasturtiums. The other one was rosellas. I didn't plant any rosellas this year and we had heaps come up. Rocket self seeds itself everywhere. We lost a lot of our strawberries, but we've probably got half a dozen plants still hanging on. The perennial basils are still going strong, along with our comfrey and sugar cane. The lemon thyme didn't make it. So back in March, I did get out and I cleared everything out of this front garden and I planted my garlic, which is going amazing at the moment. I'm so happy with it. I've planted my snow peas and my sugar snaps and they're going really well. Anyway, that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed. I hopefully will be back with more regular videos now that I'm getting a bit more inspired to get back into the garden. I'll see you guys soon.